Who am I talking to? Okay, my name is Caroline, and I'm a marketing specialist and PR manager for IPVO. IPVO, IPVO. Experience over IP, we do cool web stuff, USB peripherals. All right, well, show me, show me, this is something that was interesting to me, I wanted you to show me. What's, yes. what's the name of this? So this is the uh, POV pointer cam, and it will be available March 1st. March 1st. Yes, this is not the final stand. Uh, this is actually a sneak preview, so it's the wrong color. Okay. But it's, it's still really cool. You can detach it, put it to the sides. It's got a really cool macro, it's got auto focus, and it's plug and play. So you just put it into your Mac, single USB, and you're good to go. So it works with Photo Booth, it works with iChat, MSN Live, Skype. Now what were you saying about the focus? You said it has auto focus? Auto focus, yes. Okay, and I saw on your website something in regards to, does it have two shooting modes? Or something for up close and... Uh, Aha, uh -huh. we've changed it on this one. You, you can actually do manual focus by pressing this button right here. Okay. Or you can do auto focus. And the uh, macro is pretty good. It's about 2.3 inches. And what's the uh, resolution on the camera? 2 megapixels. 2 megapixels. So you do photos as well with it. Yes. And then the video, what's the, uh, the size? I saw 800 by 600 over 800 there. 800 by 600, that's right. <laughs> See, you know more than I do. And what's the what's the price going to be when it comes out? It's about $100, but it's not finalized, so okay, so don't it, hurt me if it's wrong. So they said about, on in March, you said, March 1st? March 1st. March 1st. So you got to show me cool stuff like this, and it's not available yet, huh? Exactly. It's just... <laughs> All right, and what else does uh, IPV, IPVO? IPVO. IPVO. What, is that, what else does IPVO have? So we have, so coming up March 1st as well, we have these two really cool products. They're called the Kaleido. This one is a wireless frame, and it's got auto-rotating features. It's got all kinds of different angles, wherever you want to put it. You also have your standard cards, MS, SD, all these things, mini USB, USB. Really cool stuff, touch sensitive buttons on top here. They don't, you know, you don't have to look for them. They're always in the same spot. Um, so what you can do is you can set up some Flickr channels, your account, your friend's account. Uh, you can also set up Picasa channels. You can do RSS feed, so you can read notebooks.com's blog or somebody else's blog. So it's wireless? It's wireless, Okay. Yes. So you just install a little piece of software on your computer and you set up channels. So let's say notebooks, notebooks.com could be a channel or Caroline's super photo stream on Flickr could be a channel. And every day it'll grab the latest content and you can see it stream. Wow. Or you can download them and so you know when your computer's away you'll still see the great photos. And it looks like this stuff is coming from an SD card, right? Uh, is there a memory card slot on here at all? Yes, there are several right here. And then you also have mini USB and USB in the back. All right, so all kinds of different ways to connect basically. Yes, and you can also take it from your iPhoto or from any folder in your computer and stream it on there. If you don't have wireless at first or you don't want to bother with it, you can also connect through a USB cable. So there's all kinds of different ways of putting content on there. So do we know the price on this? Yeah, this is going to be $199 March 1st. $199, so it's, all, it's just about the same price. Maybe a little bit more than just a, an average digital picture frame, I think. Yeah, uh, it's got the highest resolution available for a 7 inch. And it also will come, if you have an iPod or an iPhone, it'll come with an application that will serve as a remote. Wow. Wow, yeah. wow, wow. Okay. So this one connects directly onto your computer. It's called the Kaleido L7. It's mostly a widget frame, so it's to keep up with your latest blogs, with weather, with talks. It also has standalone mode, so you can still download content on there and see it separately when your computer is off. But it doesn't connect wirelessly. It connects with, through a USB. So what are we looking at right here? We've got like a calendar showing up. Oh yeah, uh, all of these are widget enabled, so you can use your Google calendars on there. Uh, you can see Google Mail, all these kinds of things. Is that all stuff? that you can configure, how do you configure those things? So same thing, you set it up as a channel and add uh, your Google Calendar, I believe, on there. And so when it's connected, either through wireless for this one or through wired on this one, it'll, it'll upload the latest content on there. So you could set up reminders on there if you wanted. Very cool. Now, what's the uh, the last couple gadgets we have over here? So those are the iconic Sky products. This is what we started with. Um, this is what's won the most awards, and all of these have been featured in the New York Times. Uh, those are Skype phones, USB. They work on both Mac and PC. This guy's just your, you know, standard headset, uh, and uh, it's got the digits to make phone calls, so that you don't have to type on keyboard, you know, like one digit at a time. This one has also an LCD, so you can just scroll through your contacts, and it has one-touch recording. So let's say you know you're in a conversation and you wanna, you can do 
interviews on it, or if you're a salesperson and you want to keep a record of what you were talking about, you can record it in WAV file or in MP4. You can Where does it record? Uh, on your computer. It records it. So there's software, the drivers or whatever there's it is. There's just a simple driver on it. Okay. And then you can edit it in GarageBand if you want. And then for the Mac fans here, we've got something else, right? The speaker phone for iChat, the Iconic. Okay. Available at app, uh, Apple stores. So it's a speaker phone. It's got a microphone right here for the speaker phone part. Or you can change it to handset and just talk privately if you need to. Now, and does that work for there. Windows as well? or? Yeah, uh, there's a different Skype, one, uh, Skype speaker phone for Windows. It's black. Okay. But it's just a question of driver, really. So if you love the white one that much, you can still buy it and get the different driver from the website. So going back really quickly, are these guys available March 1st? Both of them available March 1st? March 1st, March 1st, now. Right now. Okay. Little IP, though.